everyone, welcome to the greatest piano channel on the internet. I am Liana with Music Academy International and I'm so pleased that you are here. Today we're gonna continue finally our, um, uh, our journey series. <laughs> we did it uh, from 1 to 7, Opus 299. Right now we are to the very unexpected number eight. <laughs> I decided to do uh, a few uh, a few parts, uh, probably at least three parts. So this is gonna be our first part. Um, I would like to invite you strongly <laughs> to check out my journey Opus 299 is on the playlist under journey 299 okay number one number two number three so what's happening with journey number eight we having a mixture of all of this we're gonna have five fingers exercise <laughs> patreon.com slash music academy international inc you will have their three level um, subscription so we i'm calling it bronze silver and gold <laughs> smoking is here <laughs> so level one five dollar subscription a month so with this five dollars what you get you get all the youtube videos that they are uh, posted they will be posted over there but no uh, ads free of ads i hate ads on the same time that's the channel if you like my channel to support all the the tremendous work that i'm making here <laughs> you know free of charge obviously right then we having uh, the level silver that is ten dollars a month ten dollars a month so this level this uh, um uh, silver level it's for uh, late beginners and early intermediate so what it means this there will be all kind of tutorials not found on the youtube like beatles disney uh, sonatas sonatinas clementi kulau diabelli uh, canon in b and kind of early intermediate for you to grow and feel good and in detail explain on top of everything we will do live q a starting with april <laughs> i'm so looking forward for it then we will have the uh, gold level that is 25 dollars a month with this description with this uh, level subscription <laughs> okay with this subscription uh it's for intermediate level so we're uh, looking here for more sonatina a little bit harder and um, then we will go all the way to advance. So now we're talking Nocturne by Chopin, we're talking Reverie, Debussy, we might talk Schumann, we're talking Czerny, Opus 299. So all those master classes, they are further master classes not found on YouTube. On top of everything, this level will have, of course, live QA once a month and then we uh, there will be a 10 percent discount for uh, private sessions if you would like to take with me 30 minutes 45 minutes or one hour you will find my email into the description as well i am available starting with april as i'm recording this uh, little announcements we are in march 2022 so april is the time when i'm available right now i'm booked 2022 of course so now that being said, please find the link in the description and let's get started. Okay, I'm back. I hope you enjoyed my little announcement. So uh, let's keep going. I just changed my camera. So right now you have both cameras uh, ready for you. So 
later you will see my finger. So what do we have here? Number A. secret but it needs to be practiced and needs to be practiced um, right <laughs> right and thoroughly all right so someone you know was uh, saying that that doing a kind of a bounce of a wrist like that <laughs> Do this. Right? The 
this is rolling and is not even, right? Uh, this move from the wrist, it's coming naturally. It's coming organically when you practice right. So I never heard, I never told my students, move your wrist. No, I told my students, relax your wrist. <laughs> so when you relax your wrist, actually, it's gonna move the wrist by default, not by you making it move. It's a totally reverse situation, you see? So I'm gonna go again. Yes, it is a little tiny bit, obviously because the finger number five is, is shorter. Here we having a piano, we having a molto allegro, and this is it's gonna be played very leggero. Leggero means articulate, light, fast, crisp. <laughs> that means leggero, right? <laughs> It's rolling number three, four, five, and it's sounding like that. Right? And that is not what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be, again, crisp and even. <laughs> okay, so how we do that? Uh, through articulation. So I would I would suggest you, if you're playing right the key, the um, if you have a good um, um, scale <laughs> technique, right? Um, you can practice like that. Right? So you can do an uh, exercise like that. You do have even a hand on somewhere, number 40 something. You can look over there and then you just have scales up and down and so on and so forth. But for this situation where you have only four scales, so I, look what I'm doing it. Then, then. <laughs> 
So you can already hear that I'm doing two accents. for being with me today.